Splines are a quick go-to when creating a miter joint, as adding surface area fixes the end grain glooming problem. Back in number 47, we talked about frame miter joints being great ways to hide the end grain. But we can take this to a three-dimensional level by adding what I call dowel splines. Given time, normal splines can eventually break free. But let's look at how dowel splines are created. With this quick jig, I can drill out a few holes. These holes have a mechanical advantage as the dowels are angled inside the edge, locking the joint together. This edge will now not only have a glue adhesive to protect the joint from moving, but it'll be pinned in as well with a dowel. If you're interested in making one of these, I have a step-by-step -step instruction pinned in the comments. Sub and follow for more bite-sized tips. Keep making things.